Hey everyone, welcome to today's video where I'm going to walk you through everything you need to know to start your very first aquarium. If you're new to the hobby, don't worry, I've got you covered with some simple tips and tricks. But before we dive in, make sure to like, share and subscribe for more awesome content. All right, let's get started. The first thing you need is a tank. For beginners, I recommend starting with a 20 gallon tank. It's big enough to give your fish plenty of space, but not too overwhelming. You'll also need a filter, a heater and a good quality water conditioner to make tap water safe for your fish. Once you have your tank, you need to set it up. Start by placing it on a sturdy stand, then rinse your gravel thoroughly before adding it to the tank. Fill the tank with water, but leave some space at the top. Install your filter and heater according to the manufacturer's instructions. Now, this next step is crucial, cycling your tank. Cycling helps establish beneficial bacteria that break down harmful toxins. This process can take a few weeks, so be patient. While your tank is cycling, you can start thinking about what fish you want to keep. For beginners, I recommend starting with hardy fish like guppies, tetras or mollies. These fish are easy to care for and can tolerate a range of water conditions. Remember, don't overstock your tank. A good rule of thumb is one inch of fish per gallon of water. Once your tank is cycled and ready, it's time to add your fish. But don't just dump them in. Float the bag with the fish in the tank water for about 15 minutes to acclimate them to the temperature. Then, carefully release them into the tank. Now let's talk about maintenance. Keeping an aquarium clean is essential for the health of your fish. Do a 25% water change every two weeks. Use a gravel vacuum to clean the substrate and remove any uneaten food or waste. Check your filter regularly and replace any media as needed. And always keep an eye on your fish for any signs of illness. Feeding your fish is another important aspect. Overfeeding can lead to poor water quality and health issues. Feed your fish small amounts once or twice a day and make sure they eat everything within a few minutes. And there you have it. Starting your first aquarium might seem daunting, but with these tips and a little bit of patience, you'll be well on your way to creating a beautiful, healthy environment for your fish. Thanks for watching. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe if you found this video helpful.